Alright, we're done with a crick of the neck, eh? I did alright that time. Alright, we didn't go through things because I was too busy with the milk bucket. Fair enough. <laughs> Let's have a look around. And so I say, Be gone, accursed witch. I have occupied this grove for eons long before your pitiable tent came to rest upon it. Oh, hey, Mel. I see the two of you have met. Lord Moros, Dora speaks the truth as always. She's been here longer than I have, if you can believe it. I can indeed, for I know an old soul when I see one. It's a pleasure to meet you, Dora. Do let me know if I can be of service in some way. <laughs> Count on it, Horns. Now then. I bid your leave. Farewell. Farewell. Heh. <laughs> Nobody over here? Alright. We're set then. Welcome, Lord Charon. Let's see. Right on time. Faded fabric. Yeah, I should probably hold one of these. I don't have of those too badly. Hail, broker. Ooh. Pricey. I have need of that. Got him again? Next time you got something to say about me, you come say it to my face. No, you witches would much rather sneak around, though. What are you even talking about? I think you're being accusatory and abrasive. There, I said that to your face. Odysseus tried giving me one of his talks, telling me you didn't go complaining to him. He was concerned with how we're getting on. You're not exactly being subtle, and he's quite perceptive in case you hadn't noticed. Be quiet. <laughs> Perseverance is what got us to this point, my lord. May your resolve never waver. Whenever mine does, I take comfort knowing I have such dependable allies. Well done, Anne. Our cauldron. Need another pearl. Fair enough. Ooh. Nice. That's an eight o'clock recipe, eh? Interesting, I suppose. My choice is hereby made. My path is set. Tis done. Welcome, a learned sage. <laughs> Come, spirits of the dead. I have a task for you. Intent was true. Record keeper, pleased to have you here. Nice. <laughs> With, we could do the thing we do in Hades too, where we just build a sword cut. What does my history reveal? Yes, I had quite a lot of fails. I succeeded on night seven, but then after that, it took me way longer to get another win. Best to keep track of each detail. Right. Yeah, I want to use the axe more, damn it. It's my second fastest weapon. That's probably because I clear uh, the second zone. Well, Arctic Ring and Solar Ring are pretty good in my opinion. Oh, that? That's up the latest numbers. Oh. Yes. True enough. And then these two I've been spamming fairly often. Alright. 
Last night, Headmistress, I traversed a gate that led me to the depths of chaos, where I met its host. I've heard so much from you of Nyx, yet somehow I never expected to meet her mother and father. Of all creation, not just her. An audience with primordial chaos? <laughs> I hadn't entirely expected that. Although, given that Nyx herself has not been seen since Kronos took the House of Hades, I am unsurprised. There is no fury like that of a parent bereft of their child. Does Chaos seem an ally to us, then? I believe so. Well, thank you, Nyx, for that. Back in one piece. Up you go. We have all of these. Flourishes. Well, for quite a while, we have a dank night suit I have. Here you'll grow strong. Trying to get that other pearl, I suppose, is what we're going to be doing. Headmistress, if I may, if time cannot be stopped, then we shall see. If spill my blood I must, so mote it be. So mote it be. I can let her What to cast? Come, Saver. From heights of Olympus to depths of the sea. This will take a little while. Indeed. So Doom has come to stay with us a bit. My last and only other brush with him did not resolve particularly well, so I'll just keep my distance if that's quite all right. All children of Nyx are welcome in these crossroads. Though I think Lord Moros wishes to keep his distance too. No objections here. Halfway to Knight's Gift. Uh, I never realized. Right. So can we even get a three? No, we have two threes already. Should be taking off two twos. Or possibly something else. So no ones nor twos are allowed. Mm. Cheeseburger upon you. Don't think I can do this. Let me see. Alright, we have a thing that I have no idea what to use. This. We bid you welcome to the vanguard of the underworld. So are you gonna earn the gifts that avail over there? Or squander your chance to get some of that eternal glory? Eternal glory? If such a thing may come to those who manage to achieve extraordinary feats, so be it. But to chase glory as a goal unto itself? That can't be right. At least, it's never been our way. But our ways can change, wouldn't you say? We mustn't become mired in the olden ways of doing things. Though I don't mean to pressure you, kiddo, it's just... I think you ought to get what's yours is all. I'll think about it. The gifts of the veil. Well, I succeeded, right? Yep, conquer the underworld and conquer the surface at tier 8. What, do I have to do both? Cheeseburger thing. What weapon are we using? Axe. Good. I like the axe. Axe. The oath of the unseen. And it wants me to go up top, eh? Uh, 
finds because I already have everything plotted out. It's the only reason. <laughs> Let's see, we still need iron and stuff, so I'll be taking that. You did decent. Let's see. <sighs> Tepid as this is. Through a fira. Let's go. Smash. Or the Silver Sisters. It's rather heavy still. to get through these relics. You'd keep them busy for a while. You must be very strong, like me. Hey. Sir. The tides come in. I don't think I've literally ever more. used this skill. Something's different this time. I like Hephaestus, so up left for ult, bottom right for Medea, and then uh, Hephaestus, probably Poseidon, and then Zeus, Zeus. Sorry. That barrier's back up. Another pylon. <laughs> you are growing closer to manifesting the reality that we have long since sought. May you yet drain whatever light is left in him. Behold my light. Your terrifying form. Hi. <laughs> Still running down the clock on me, eh? The barrier's lost some of its strength. Pylon 
destroyed. Whatever happens to you there, I cannot be held liable. I work weapons, not miracles. Hmm. Fair enough. Done here. The honors, please, Freenos. See you in the crossroads. Lord. Remember, I am supposed to get to Medea like early. Some boost. Oh, yeah, like bonus day, mana every four. Find your peace. In one forgotten recess of the fallen city, a solitary seeker of profane mysteries conducts her undertakings beneath a pale, distant moon. I've learned a curse or two. Oh, from this welcome, one. Lady Medea. I almost pity our enemies, knowing you shall make them rue each night they dare oppose us, Lady Medea. Please, I wanted you to have this. The nectar of the gods. Why, this shall be most useful to my work, for the strongest curses come from honeyed words. Here, let me make this worth your while. From one sorceress to another. Thank you. Black and fleece. Ah, the sorceress returns. Not had your fill of this putrescent atmosphere, or merely not succeeded yet in breaking the Titan siege. Not succeeded yet. Kronos can replenish his forces as quickly as Olympus can repel them. Have you found any weaknesses in their ranks? They cannot be permanently slain, are barely susceptible to my most noxious poisons, and are single-minded in their devotion to the Titan Lord. Any of those sound like weaknesses? I doubt it will work, but it will at least remove the which I appreciate because well it's bothering me. alive upon the surface here no less you cured your curse somehow impossible it. Mm -hmm. prime 50 kind of sucks a lot but hey thunderous power more pylons are nearby What else is here? Eh, yeah, top right will take less time for Hermes and Lightning Guy. All known as Zeus. Him again. Well, don't just stand there, sister. We've a war here to perpetuate. They can't. Hold still in their shades. <laughs> One down, one to go. Why is there a spinny glaive thing? Who did this? You? See that? you?
really. I won by a on my authority. That's all it takes, huh? Weak. Great son of Zeus, I offer you this gift of nectar, that it may quench your thirst as you labor for the gods. They must be grateful for your might. <laughs> Saves me having to find another bottle for when next I have to prove my fealty. Here, something for your trouble. No trouble at all, thank you. You made it out before. Cyclops must have caught your scent, though. He's strong, that one. That's a ringing endorsement. Though you must be stronger still. Ever considered putting him to the test? Could save me a lot of trouble. He's not my type. Besides, he's a spawn of the gods, just like you and me. Wouldn't be proper if we were all fighting all the time now, would it? We're done here. Well, now I think the only thing I need is, uh, what, Demeter and somebody else's? looking out for you and all of us. Our speeds are pretty quick as well. Mm. I could use taking a less damage. Coinage. Finished here. At last. Olympus, I accept this message. Moonlight guides you. It is indeed. Did you enjoy your nap? I made those dots back there with my bare hands. You know some guys? They tally every skiff and trireme in the drink. We know where you're going. So what if you do? You're just another servant of Kronos. The gods shall punish you when all this is over. Eh, what do you know about it? They only care about their own. I'm just a joke to them. Am I a joke to you? Yes. <laughs> really, I thought that, that would, you know, block it like a smoke. Nothing fucking happened. Then I appreciate it. Hey, this time do your damn job. Why do I still have my axe?
survived all that. If once this was a pasture in which livestock grazed and roamed, now little evidence of this remains. Only the mud and half-burnt vestiges of a more peaceful time. Polyphemus should be tending to this place. Collection grows. The fleece. Calm that shade down, Frenos. See you in the crossroads. A reward for taking obscene amounts of damage. Just a little night sea journey. What's to fear? <laughs> well, and I do to you, you Zabana's ladies. Well, and I do to you, ladies. <laughs> Must want something to eat. Well, we received orders to sail for <laughs> And we'll roar like true British sailors. We'll run down along the salt sea. <laughs> 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 so well known and loved among the mortals that he had no choice but to involve himself in our most recent family affair bending to mortal pressure like a bow <laughs> now uncle i don't yield to pressure quite so easily i just knew this situation would be more than you could handle on your own we're not just family we're a team aren't we oh you god Pushed her far enough. I am a sprint build. Are you fucking with me, game? I saw these huge black wings on the horizon. Definitely not a harpy. I could have sworn it was bloody Ares. But 
Wasn't she still at the crossroads with you? Well, I'm not at the crossroads either, but unfortunately, Strife Incarnate has been getting in my way. So she showed up around the time I did. Come to think of it, yes. Ah, I was beginning to worry she was here because of something I did. Never occurred to me she was just following you around, same as ever. Sassy. And peace to you. The sweet and pungent aromas emanating from the cauldron of the witch enchantress Circe suggest the depth of her ability, whether as a practitioner of ancient arts or as a cook. I can breathe freely here. You've one of Great Selene's precious blessings on this eve. That I can tell, Puppet. Even from afar, the moon has always kept me company. Her light can be so utterly transformative. And may Selene's light ever shine for us, madam. I'd likely not have found my way to you if not for her. As for her magic, sometimes I wonder if it isn't transforming me so much as revealing who I really am. That may well be so. Who is to say where our true nature lies? A spell of transformation is a spell of revelation. When we change, we become more like ourselves. Not less. Hmm. Ooh. I like that. But I'm going to go with this. Go now with grace. Felt that for sure. Good to know that if I can get here uh, with like just the uh, like plus ten, then it can be removed. Consistent when you're stunned people before they hit me in the face and block things. Wait. Can't do it.
shocking every time. Hopefully we get a heal here before we go into Eris. That shade needs you, Freenos. I get the other driftwood, I remember that. <laughs> I assume I picked it up. All right, 140 HP. Mm, not the best keepsake. Not the best form. Definitely not the best equipment in terms of boons. And on uh, heat eight. And we've been recording for about 40 minutes. No low. Sure. Got here first. Isn't this great trouble? Now, before I shoot you all to hell, I just want us both to take a moment to breathe, relax, really just appreciate all that we have. These senseless fights with you, I cannot rightly say I appreciate them at all. So, at least the moon is beautiful tonight? That's the spirit! Now, how about we stain that pale glow of hers in blood and ichor, huh? And we'll let the sea drink its fill for good measure. <laughs> Polyphemus is a better boss design than you. And I hate him. Daughter of Nyx turn against us. And give me such a drubbing, too. Hey. Oh, hey, Mal. I was just floating. Floating around, I guess. And existing. Just kind of existing a lot lately. You? 
Failing, making progress, I don't know. Speaking of, shouldn't you be practicing your haunting, Dora? Oh, yeah, no, I thought maybe I'd take a break from that. Why well, do now, what you could do later, right? For the sense of accomplishment? Hmm. Greetings. Hail, Lord Moros. How have you been acclimating so far? Is there something we can do to make your stay more comfortable? No, Princess. I'm well and acclimating, as you say. I've never been to such a place as this, and making every effort not to be a nuisance here. You're welcome here and safe. We had to sot me. Why was there trash here if you're not here? Trouble. I know you're around here. Much is to be learned from history, if one but studies the lessons hidden in any purported accounts. A lifelong pursuit, in and of itself. Still no telling what the future holds. <laughs> Smells delicious. Susceptible to mere baubles such as this. Ha, just kidding. Totally susceptible. Gimme. <laughs> At last I have discovered a vulnerable point in your defenses. Nice. <sighs> oh, I want the moon dust. Another failed attempt. About ready to give in. You don't have the fire. This isn't personal enough for you. Isn't personal? You don't see my mother around either, do you, Nem? Nor my father. Nor my brother. Kronos took them all. I lost more than my mother, too. And I knew mine. What's yours to you? All you ever did was fall out of her womb. Silence. Something's report. Oh, she's gone. Never How was the surface? Yeah. Still warm and welcoming, I reckon. You ought to be commended for even setting foot up there. It was dreadful. The city of Afira is completely overrun, and there's a blind cyclops making sure no one gets out. Well, that all sounds entirely unfortunate. Blind cyclops, huh? That must be Polyphemus. Given that scrape myself way back, he's still going on about eating people. He is. Oh. Got these twin lures, Odd, and I can't exactly use them on my own. You know the rules. Fishing. Oh, my greatest weakness, Goddess. The waters and I have never mixed too well. But then, who am I to say no to you? Besides, I'm overdue for a short leave, I think. Let's go. It used to be I fished out of necessity alone. The Earth would oft be stingy with her bounties, whilst the sea would yield plenty to us mortals if we knew where to look. What's been the biggest difference for you since those times? Not having to eat for sustenance. Not having to watch your mortal body slowly fall apart as you grow older. <laughs> well, you already know a couple of those points if for some reason we were tasked to make a list, but... The biggest difference if I had to choose is that... I finally am free. You're free? But as a mortal, weren't you a king? A mighty warrior, leader of men, and a husband, and a father. Here you have a place of honor too, except we dwell in shadows. Our deeds are never to be told. Well, we shall see about that last bit, but for the rest... Perhaps I got all of the wanderlust out of my system whilst I lived and breathed. Most of it, anyhow. Poseidon can't help you here, little fish. Heh. <laughs> Now come along. <laughs> I thoroughly enjoyed our outing, though I still thoroughly hate fish. Nice. Puppies. Now I sort of uprooted all of these, but we didn't really get any new ones. Yeah, all we got is nightshade. Take 
all the time you need. Shrine of Hermes to get money. Now, shades of the dead, reagents in the pot, heed now my plea, become what I have sought. So mote it be. Our cauldron. When do I get another fecking familiar video game? Aspect. Mm, I must already have it. You can hear me, can't you? Don't already have it. Santa Claus is. Grant me the aspect of Medea. Oh, she's a scary one. She is. <laughs> yes, you are the bone boosted. The silver pool. <laughs> to all of you just joining up, welcome. Not a bad skull you got. Aspects of the nocturnal arms. There's a lot more of a melee. That way to victory, young one. But to earn the gifts of the veil, one must conquer the underworld and the surface realms upon a fearful night each in turn. You up for it? For the glory of the underworld and the everlasting rule of night, I would do everything in my ability. Whether that makes me worthy of the gifts of the veil, I know not. Come on, what kind of attitude is that? You did the underworld already, now you just gotta do the surface and the gifts are yours. First one of them, at least. Come on, do it. Okay. A healthy fear of darkness. Good, it stays crossed out. Heed well the oath. Four more points for Polly Dickhead. I swear it, Nick. Kicking his ass. This way, this time. No stupid melee axe bullshit. This is my path. Whether we think you ought to join in our defense here, or take the fight to Kronos in your father's realm, and you'll get a range of views. A range of highly simple views, which we don't fight about at all. Uh, 
never takes the spirit Surging bubble up on. again. I would, quite frankly, rather die. Time to break through again. The barely held together city is a labyrinth of streets. Some barricaded still, yet others not. Each horror filled, night after endless night. So many mortals lived and died in such a place. Mandra, Medea. Essence. Good evening. I'm wielding your head. How long have you resided here, Lady Medea? I thought all our forces fled once the city was overrun, but you seem rather comfortable. Oh, yes. All the death and panic made for many vacancies. I slipped in through the shadows soon after the city fell and remained, practicing, observing. Great Hecate has eyes upon the surface everywhere. Shall be my pleasure. Thank you. Another nectar bottle you can spare on my behalf? Oh, this shall be a splendid compliment with several much less pleasant ingredients. Whose aroma this ought to disguise. I shudder to think what concoction you have in mind. Though trust you shall make use of that in service to our cause. Relax, pepperoni. I know, I'm the one who's high strung right now, but still, who should chill? Show me the surroundings. Let's see, top right has a bunch of stuff we can do. And I no longer trust Hephaestus to get the job done. So we're getting Hammer, we're getting uh, Apollo, and we're getting... <laughs> the barrier's weakening. So how's it going? Look at you, sister. Your brother once had us all convinced he was trying to fight his way to Olympus. Now none of us can believe you're trying to do it for real. Hermes wouldn't have asked me to go if it wasn't important. Besides, I could use the change of scenery. Then by all means. What a time that you're on your way up to the mountain while I'm on my way down to the underworld. At least we cross paths. <laughs> to head back again. Peace, sir. Need a break from all the slaughter. Just stand back. Far back. Prepare. 
I said, hey, we've not collaborated much as before, not with everything of late. I miss those times. Even the gods have their price. Time to send a message. All dead. You work, you get paid. Sure you don't want to give me only half the bottle there? Seeing as I'm nearly half a god. I got their strength, but seldom get their luxury. Nothing's gained from luxury in excess anyway. But there are times a little doesn't hurt. May this soothe your spirit when the occasion arises. Stay strong, son of Zeus. Hmm. I know what you are, you bloody witches. One foreign word, one finger-wagging gesture directed at me. And I'll squeeze you till you pop. That won't be necessary. Though I would know how came you to feel this way about us bloody witches. How many have you met? Two questions too many. The more you know, the more you can manipulate. Now off with you. Peace. birthright meant you couldn't live up here you're just full of surprises so headed this way let me help A wave of power. Advised. 
Hermes wanted me to tell you, hey, my lord. A message he'd surely deliver himself if he could. Though he seems well enough. Of course, my lord. Gods watch over us. Farewell, Lord Charon. Really? Are you the one responsible for that spectral barrier at the city gates? It has the markings of Kronos all over it. And you seem to be the extra backup in case it fails. Oh, that thing, yeah. I knew it never hold. But they keep fixing it anyway. Almost like somebody out there don't want you here. <laughs> Well, Cyclops. In shadow I serve. Go, Prinus. <laughs> Should I change things up? It's still connected to the main fleet. Don't be afraid. Transfer me.
some driftwood. Just what you wanted, right? Nobody wants you playing favorites, would you? So we've got this method of delivering you unmarked boons where you'll just have to take what you can get. Surprise! surface here that is i thought you couldn't tolerate this place yet here you are strutting across the war-torn land as though it's yours by right now for the next one charge. one. 
Freinos, hypnotize. Perspective, those waters must appear to have no end, but they do end, and you have means to quickly cut across. I shall watch you sail on and help you make haste. The choice is yours. Then wield my light with grace. You have it. Selene's hidden strength. Let's pick up the pace. Death to Kronos. You. Hate to do this to you, babe, but... Oh, who am I kidding? Golden apple. 
to feel again the stable earth beneath her feet replenishes within the princess of the underworld her nearly limitless resolve as her objective finally draws near. Mount Olympus. There it is ahead. The heights of Mount Olympus loom so close, and yet the surface scouring princess can go no closer for the moment. Although it never hurts to try. No! Return to shadow now! Returned. Ah, oh, Frenos. Perhaps I ought no better than to tamper with the Oath of the Unseen. Hey. Everything all right, Dora? Any new hauntings need evaluation or anything? Ah, oh, I'm, I'm fine. It's just... I think I've hit a bit of a slump, is all. Happens, right? I'll get over it. Good. Hey, if you're not busy, up for a little visit with me to the riverside? I've got a twin lure we could use right here. Don't know that I'll be doing you much good, between my inability to use a rod of fishing and my inability to keep quiet, but hey, you asked for it. Ah, this is gonna be so fun. Seems like an awful lot of trouble for some weird fish. Any time now? It's something, all right. Well, that definitely was a thing that happened. Thanks. Bye. Okay, bye. Oh, hello. I learned what happened to the Fates, Lord Moros. Or rather, how Kronos discovered where they were. It was Chaos who led Kronos to them. Chaos, of course, seems to regret this now, and I don't think had any ill intent. Oh. That is a lot of information to take in. It does make some amount of sense. Kronos having free reign in your father's house, eventually found his way to Chaos, then coaxed this vital information out of them. Then he ambushed the Fates as part of his plans for conquest. You're taking all this better than I would have. Come to think of it, I've never seen you angry. You're seeing me right now. It's just, my anger changes nothing, typically. So Chaos now is working to undo some of the damage caused. Kronos removed one thread in the Fates, but created another. Perhaps an unwise trade. Making a mockery of Chaos seems commotion? unwise to me. Is this what you want, Eris? To have our aimless clashes, only then to sneer at one another here again and again. Such a worthy cause. Who are you to say what makes a worthy cause? Cause, yeah, I happen to be quite alright with everything. It's genuinely been a real blast. You're unbelievable. Thanks, Trouble. Such a mess.
as usual, no one informs me when there are people in the house. <sighs> Jeez, poor dude. <laughs> you heard this, I don't see much use for Ambrosia or this place since... We welcome you. I haven't seen anyone who'd be willing to even take the stuff. I was curious to see if you would consecrate the altar of ashes on your own. It ought to be further attuned to you as a result. The secrets of the Arcana nearer to your grasp. The altar is the threshold through which we all pass going to and from these crossroads. A gateway to the past, present and future. I know it isn't mine alone. It's ours. Correct. On all three counts. Yes, yes. The number three is important. What you said to me before about my mother. That was very cruel. Hmm. Fair enough. Can't kill each other here, but we can use our words. If we were fighting for real, I wouldn't have held back either. I figured not. Now we wait. <laughs> Trade you. Never going fishing with I encountered here, mighty Heracles on the surface. No mistaking him, though I thought he was dead. He seemed very much alive, on the outside anyway, and still in service to the gods. The great Heracles, that's a complicated one. Part man, part god, part monster too, perhaps. Rules of death don't quite apply to him. What did he want? Did he give you any trouble? He was quite brusque, told me to stay out of his way. Sounds like he has a task of his own. Maybe Olympus isn't counting on me to succeed. Yeah, don't take it personally. You have wise relatives and ruthless ones. They may not like their odds hinging on any one individual. And do watch yourself with Heracles, I. I. You're ready. Oh, what have we there? That's a nice touch. Into the earth you go. I have an idea. <laughs> oh, these are like the Well of Charon, but for her. Interesting. Like it. Come, Saver. Unrivaled from heights of Olympus to depths of the sea. It'll be worth the wait. Well, we just keep stealing apples from Eris. Your prize awaits and glory is yours. A third of it, anyway. The deed is done. And now, unto the champion of night, the spoils. Oh. <sighs> Commander, is that supposed to be... me? It is night's champion, foretold by fate. She who shall strike fear into the hearts of those who stand against the realm and stuff like that. I can see you're at a loss for words, such as the splendor of her likeness. And this is just the first of them. Indeed. And are the other gifts just as, um, detailed? Either way, I'm not so certain I can handle twice, let alone three times the glory. When my task is difficult enough as it is. Ah, so then the fear is getting to you. Do not give in to it, young one. Instead, give in to curiosity about those other glorious gifts. Think it a prestige. Now you can be a little scaredy quitter or knight's champion. Which is it gonna be? Do I have to decide this instant? Nah, you take however long you need. She sure looks strong. Ain't she a beaut? <sighs> The will of night. Out your eyes and drown you to death. This I vow. Yeah, I'm never doing that one. Besides, we're going down under the sea. So, uh, I hate the scepter. We haven't used this stuff in a while. Give me this stuff. Discura. Oh. 
saucy. That stick has got some heft. Observe, my disciples. Yeah, no, maybe when you upgrade that one, it can be okay, but for me, nah, nah, nah. Not a fan. Well, that's an easy upgrade. New life for the Tablets of Peace. Hey, what just happened? Specific to when you use the no. Uh, which only once this night. That's annoying. The crescent pick achieves a greater form. Well, what was that? Grant me the aspect of Eos. Ah, rosy fingered dawn. Do I dare? I just like being on top of it. That fear may spread. Mind you, I ain't doing a triple feature. God, the number of people who actually make it through this deal would drop to. It's gonna be one already, but still. I don't want to be through eight hours of content in a single episode. So I'll see you guys next time. See ya.